If you've ever wondered how to customize your Ipsy Glam Bag Plus, here's a short tutorial. First, you're gonna open your Ipsy app and Ipsy will show you the picks that they've chosen for you based on your beauty profile. And they've chosen for me the Nomad Cosmetics Berlin Underground Palette and the Tarte Double Duty Beauty Shape Tape Translucent Powder. And then you get to move on to choose your three products. And it gives you a list of options for your first product, as you can see here. And then your second product, you can see the options to choose from. And then you move on to your third product and the options that you have to choose from on that. Now I had a little bit of difficulty deciding. So the first thing that I actually decided on was the House Laboratories lip gloss. And then I had some trouble deciding on the second one. There are a lot of lip products to choose from, but you can click on each product and get a description, a value, and a how to use on it to help you decide. Now I keep going back and forth. You can click off of it if you decide you don't want that first thing that you chose and you can click on something else to see if that's what you'd like. I was interested in the Violet Voss palette too. Ultimately I decided on the house laboratories and then I scrolled down to my second category and took a look at the different products there. They had the Ciate London translucent powder but I was already getting a translucent powder so that didn't seem like a good option. The lip tinted balms from Dr. Lip seemed like a good choice and that's what I ultimately chose. And my third category, I had heard a lot of good things about the Ciate London Watermelon Burst Hydrating Primer. You can choose it right from its product screen or you can go back and look at the other products again. Decide if that's really what you want and then click on it. Here I'm reviewing my choices. You can scroll up to the top and see the three things that you've chosen. I'm sorry, my dog's barking in the background. He hears me talking to you. And up at the top, you can scroll along and see what you've chosen for your box. Those are my three choices. I'm happy with that. I scroll down to the bottom. They show them again. And then I confirmed it and it moves you to the add-ons page. So the next page that you go to are your add-ons. And you can choose products that maybe you did not decide or things that weren't offered to you and go from there. Now, I love Sunday Riley and I see the CEO and the A plus retinoid serums and any chance I can get Sunday Riley for less than full price, I'm gonna do it. So I add both of those to my cart. And then I move down the screen and it shows you other items that you could add as well. And these are for the $18 price. You move down to the $12 price for full price for full size items. And take a look at the other items that are there. I have that Dominique Cosmetics palette. I have the Huda Beauty palette, but I would really like to try that Glow Recipe Toner. So I get that and I move down. Looking down, they have more of the items that could have been in your box. And then they have the $3 deluxe size products. We're going on vacation and I love the Luna Night Oil. So I got a vacation sized Luna Night Oil. I move down and look at the rest of the items. Nothing there interests me. So we keep going and keep going. There are many choices. I'm sad that the Mac lashes are sold out. Move back up. The Gimme Brow is not in my shade for benefit, making sure I didn't miss anything that I would really like. And I moved down to the $3 category and I like the SL Miss Glam brushes. So I got a blush brush from them for $3, which is a fantastic price. I review my order and I confirm and it tells me what my bag is worth. So my $25 investment plus my add-ons is worth $343. 
and then it runs down and it gives you a list of all of the items that could be in the boxes this month. So you can scroll down and see what items could have possibly been in the different boxes. It starts out with the Glam Bag Plus, and you can see all of the items that you could have gotten. You see the items that I've chose as well, and the ones that were chosen for me. A few of my add-ons are in there as well. And then the Glam Bag products. So those are the things that you have the possibility to get in your October Ipsy Glam Bag. I apologize again for my dog. My sadness is that they don't have the O for Cosmetics in the Glam Bag Plus. Keep scrolling seeing all the products that you had the possibility to get. And some of these are deluxe sizes, some of these are sample sizes. And then when you go down to the Glam Bag Ultimate, these are the items that could have been in your Glam Bag Ultimate this month. Now I only subscribe to the Glam Bag Plus at this current time. If you'd like to see me unbox the Glam Bag Ultimate or the regular Ipsy Glam Bag, please let me know. I'd be more than happy to get another one. It gives me more items for giveaways as well. And there we go. That's our tutorial.